Hey everybody. Some people have had the chance to go over how to do spelling in Spanish and some people want us, have asked us for a review of it. So that's the first of the two videos. This is the first of the two videos that accompany this unit. The first thing we're going to do is we're going to look at how to do spelling in Spanish. So get a pen and paper ready because we're going to bring up some important information that you may need in the future. The first thing to remember is that in Spanish, we don't actually say the el alfabeto when we're talking about the alphabet. The proper term for it is el abecedario. I'll say that word again, abecedario. And here's something that I personally love about Spanish. Every letter in a word is pronounced, which is great. It's really different from English because in English, we have a lot of silent letters. But in Spanish, if you see a letter, you say it which is, makes things really easy. And just as a reminder, capital letters are called mayúscula, and if it's a small case letter or a lowercase letter, it's called minúscula. So let's get ready to try and practice the alphabet. I'll say each letter two times. You pronounce the letter after I say it. Let's start. Ah. A, B, B, C, C, D, D, E, E. Notice that this is not E. In Spanish, this is E. F, F. G, G, H, H, I, I, J, J, K, K, L, L. Now notice that this is slightly different from the EJ which is the two L's together. Some dictionaries and some uh, textbooks may have the words with the two L's separated from the ones with the one L's. If you do, it's because it's a slightly different sound. It's called EJ. EJ. M. M. N. 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 And, very particular to Spanish, N. -ye. Enye. O. O. P. P. Q. Q. R. R. S. S. P. T. U, U, Uve, Uve, Uve doble, Uve doble, X, X, Y, Y, Z, Z. One other thing to remember is that even though the verb of to spell is deletrear in Spanish, you don't ask somebody how to deletrear something. Rather, the, the way expression that we use in Spanish is, if we want to say, how do you spell something, you actually say, how do you write something? And it sounds like, como se escribe, whatever. So let's practice with some really common words. Okay, now it's your turn to do some spelling. We're going to look at some very, very common words that you'll be using in the class. And if you want, we'll practice a little bit more at the end. Please note as well that the second video is going to be spelling, but it's actually going to be acronyms and short words. But let's take some words for now that we know. For example, 
Hmm. ¿Cómo se escribe estar? Estar se escribe E S T A R. Ready? Here's the next one. ¿Cómo se escribe Ottawa? Ottawa se escribe O T T A W A. Here's the next one. Hmm. ¿Cómo se escribe clase? Clase se escribe C L A S E. Clase. And last but not least, the name of one of profess one of our professors. Valdez. ¿Cómo se escribe Valdez? V doble. Perdón. V A L D E Z. Valdez. Muy bien. You've done a great job. Remember that you can watch this video as many times as you want if you want to practice with the alphabet some more. And for our next video, we'll look at how to spell and use acronyms in Spanish.